dok brojni mladi ljudi iz Bosne i Hercegovine odlaze u Njemačku u potrazi za boljim poslovnim mogućnostima, mladi Njemac Lukas iz Hamburga se preselio u Sarajevo, a bavi se netipičnim poslom koji u Bosni i Hercegovini ljudi često ni ne smatraju poslom. Naime, Lukas je influencer, tiktoker. Iako njegova obitelj nema nikakve veze sa našom državom, Lukas je za Bosnu i Hercegovinu čuo od svojih prijatelja, te se vrlo brzo odlučio na selitbu. Basically it is because of two of my friends. They are with me here. They are on TikTok too. So maybe you saw them. It's it's funny because um they do the same like me. Um but I'm the lucky one and I'm here now. But uh, I won't forget them. So their names are Razi and, and Niklas and they've been here two times for holiday and they just liked it. I mean, look at it, it's so beautiful here. So they just decided to move here and they asked me if I can come with them. And I just said yes and that's why I'm here. So because of my two friends Razi and Niklas. Njegova karijera dozvoljava mu da radi iz bilo koje zemlje u kojoj se nalazi, pa je i ranije često putovao. Upravo zbog tih putovanja njegovi roditelji nisu ostali previše iznenađeni njegovom odlukom o selitbi. My family was not that curious because in August I moved away to to Macedonia. And so it was not a new situation for them and they got to know that yet. So therefore it was not nothing special for them. They just were okay, have a good time. Enjoy the time in Bosnia and come back and visit us for for Christmas or something like that. And yeah, that's it. Svatko tko dođe na Balkan prvo što primijeti je raznovrstan glazbeni opus koji se ovdje sluša. Nekome se to sviđa, a nekome ne. Lukas u svakom slučaju ima svog glazbenog favorita, a osim glazbe tu je i hrana, priroda te bogata povijest koju Bosna i Hercegovina ima. Yeah, Sika Alexis, Crno i Slatno is my favorite song. Yeah, I pretty like Chivapi. Chivapi is, Chivapi is really good, I think it's one of the best Chivapi I've ever, ate, I've ever eaten. And the mountains are beautiful, I mean, when you're up on the hill and you can see the other side and the houses and the mountains and the clear blue sky like we have it today, it's very beautiful. And yeah, the city is just a vibe, it's, it's so historical, it's so religious, it's, it's so cultural. It's very good, I like it. U Sarajevo je stigao prije dva tjedna, pa se još uvijek upoznaje sa glavnim gradom, ali uskoro planira posjetiti i druge gradove. No, not yet. Not yet. Not yet. Sadly, I, I haven't been yet into another town. But my friends, I told you, Razi Niklas, they've been to Mostar and they pretty liked it. And they told me, oh my god, we definitely need to go to Mostar one day. And I will do it, I think, yeah. Promjena životne sredine pozitivno je utjecala i na njegov posao, pa u kratkom vremenu, otkako živi u Sarajevu, broj njegovih pratitelja neprestalno raste. So, the difference here is that I, yeah, that I get more attention. Because I think it's not that usual for a German to move into Bosnia. And therefore I think the people like it. And that's why I, I got so many followers through the two weeks I've been here. And that's why I'm here, I think. Because people like, like the fault that a German moves into their country. And in Germany it's harder to, be, to, to become a TikToker because, yeah, the market is flooded. It's full. It's full with so many TikTokers. And yeah, that's it. Ovo mu nije prvi put da putuje Balkanom, pa je posjetio i neke zemlje u okolici Bosne i Hercegovine koje su na njega ostavile veliki utjecaj svojim prirodnim ljepotama i kulturom. Croatia? I really like Croatia. It's so beautiful. The beaches are so good. And yeah, Macedonia. Besides that, I've been, I don't know, I think Hungary is not a Balkan country. Or is it? Yeah, like a little bit. I've been to Hungary a few times because my grandparents, they live there. And to Slovenia, but just for transit. So I don't know, Slovenia that good. But um, in conclusion, Bosnia is the best Balkan country I've ever been to. So yeah. Sve zemlje koje je posjetio imaju nešto što mu se svidjelo, ipak Bosnu i Hercegovinu ne planira uskoro napustiti. No, not for now. For now I'm I'm very happy to be here and I want to stay here for the next years because I just like it. I don't know, I think I'm Balkan addicted or something like that because it's not the usual for for a German to love the Balkan. But yeah, I like it and I want to stay here the next years, yeah. U svojim videima pokazuje znamenitosti Sarajeva ili svoju svakodnevnu rutinu, a najdraže mu je kada to dvoje može spojiti, pa nemojte se iznenaditi ako ga sretnete kako u sred grada radi sklekove.